So dear students, let's have a look at some very important questions from your examination point of view and in this way you will come to know what the importance of this chapter is and what the imp important points in this chapter are, right? The chapter 4, the anime, answer the following question, who was Dr. Sadao? I have already given you an introduction, but still, who was Dr. Sadao and where was his house, right? So, Dr. Sadao Hoki, his full name, Dr. Sadao Hoki was an eminent Japanese surgeon. I told you he was a Japanese and at the age of 20, he was sent to America to learn medical sciences and to learn science at the age of 20, right? And at, uh, when he was 30, he got back to Japan after becoming a great and perfect surgeon as well as a scientist, right? So, Japanese surgeon and scientist. He has spent 8 valuable years, I told you from the age 20 to 28, he spent his valuable time in learning medical sciences and science, valuable years of his youth in America to learn all that he could be learned of surgery and medicine there. He was perfecting a discovery which would render wounds entirely clean. Actually the subject, the theme of this learning medical science was how to save human beings despite their badly injuries, badly wounded being, right. So this is. So dear students, first question as we were doing, we were explaining. So, Dr. Sadao's house, house was built, this is the part of the question, what was the part of the question, where was his house, right. So, his house was built on rocks well above a narrow beach that was outlined with bent pines, pines means pine trees, right and it was on a spot of the Japanese coast, got it. Question number 2, will Dr. Sadao be arrested on the charge of harboring, harboring means giving shelter to an enemy? Let us see, Dr. Sadao knew that they would be arrested if they sheltered a man in their house. The wounded man was a prisoner of war who had escaped with a bullet on his back. Since Japan was at war with America, harboring or giving shelter to an, Amer to an American enemy meant being a traitor to Japan because the war was going on between America and Japan, right? Dr. Sadao could be arrested if anybody of his household or anybody from outside also came to know that he had already given shelter to one of the American soldiers, the enemy. So, he would have been behind the bars against him and accused him of giving shelter or harboring an enemy, right? Next question is, you can see, will Hannah help the wounded man and wash him herself? Was she interested? In the very beginning, in one of the points, we came to know that in the beginning, initially she was just reluctant to help that American soldier. Hmm? So, the gardener and the cook were frightened that their master was going to, their master means Dr. Sadao was going to heal the wound of a white man, an enemy. They felt that after being cured, he means the white man would take revenge on the Jap Japanese. You mean the household servant, maid servant, the maid was also frightened and she refused to wash the white man. Hannah rebuked the maid who had refused to wash a wounded helpless man. Then she dipped a small clean towel, towel into the steaming hot water and washed the white man's face after Dr. Sadao had insisted her to help him. Right dear students? She kept on washing him until his upper body was quite clean, means she wanted to clean the face, clean the upper body of the wounded person and she did it. Our next question, will Dr. Sadao be arrested on the charge of harboring an enemy? Will he be arrested? If yes, why? If not, why? It was the seventh day since Dr. Sadao had operated upon the young white man. Early that morning, their three servants left together, right? Yumi, the gardener and the cook, right? 
early that morning their three servants left together in the afternoon a messenger came there in official uniform they got frightened in the introduction i told you he told dr sadao that he had to come to the uh, to the palace at once means their japanese palace where the general was there okay at once as the old general was in pain again then only they could come to know that it was not their mistake and means they could not the general could not come to know what was going on in their house hana who had thought that the officer had come to arrest dr sadao or the messenger is it all then the messenger got confused what what made you say is that all oh, no 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 nothing is there the baffled messenger inquired if it if that was not enough she tried to cover her mistake by expressing regret and admitted that the general's illness was enough yes dr sadao told the general about the white man he had operated upon since dr sadao was indispensable means unavoidable the general could not live without dr sadao because dr sadao was really an authentic and reliable doctor and the general totally dependent on him he was totally dependent on him he promised that dr sadao would not be arrested this assurance was given by the general to sadao what will dr sadao do to get rid of the man means american prisoner of war dr sadao had told the old general that he had operated upon a white man the general promised to send his private assassins to kill the man silently and secretly at night and remove his body dr sadao left the outer partition of white man's room open this means he also wanted the assassins to come to his house and what are they wanted to do with that american soldier they could so he he waited anxiously for three nights the servants had left their house his wife hana had to cook clean the house and serve the wounded man means all household chores had to be performed by hana herself and she was unaccustomed to this labor actually she was the woman who had servants all around so she was not used to that right she was unaccustomed to this labor she was anxious that they should get rid of the man dr sadao told tom tom is the name of that american soldier right the white man that he was quite well then he offered to put his boat on the shore that night it would have food mean the boat would be full of necessary things that man might require right food and extra clothing and a tom might be able to row to the little island which was not far from that coast it had not been fortified not been protected right so the water was quite deep nobody lived there as it was submerged in storm right it was risky that island was risky that's why nobody would dare to go over there since it was not the season of storm he could live there till he saw till he saw a korean fishing boat pass by he gave the man his flashlight he was to signal twice with his flashlight at sunset in case his food ran out in case he was still there and all right he was to signal only once Dr Sadao gave the man Japanese cloths and covered his blond head with a black dot. In short, Dr Sadao helped the man to escape from Japan. He helped him as much as possible for him. At the same time, he also got rid of the man, right? This is very important. Sometimes it just happens. What There are moments in life when we have to make hard choices between our roles as private individuals and as citizens with a sense of national loyalty means once we have found ourselves in such a pitiable situation that there is a conflict between our profession and our citizenship means our duty for our nation and our duty for profession 
right. So, discuss with reference to the story you have just read. Dr. Sudha Hoki faces a dilemma means confusion the state of confusion when he finds the body of an unconscious wounded white man lying on the lonely curse with dangerous rocks near his house. His first reaction was that the person was perhaps a fisherman who had been watched from his boat right. He ran quickly down the steps his wife Hannah came behind him when they came near Sadao found that the man was wounded and lay motionless his face was in the sand as they saw his face they found that he was a white man with long yellow hair means blonde hair and a rough yellow beard. Being an expert surgeon Dr. Sadao saw that the man had a the man had a gun wound on the right side of his lower back he at once packed the wound with sea moss so that bleeding might be stopped right to strength the fearful <coughs> bleeding since japan was at war with america the white man was an enemy dr sadao muttered what shall we do with this man he answered the question himself the best thing that we could do would be to put him back in the sea his wife approved of his decision she also agreed then sadao made another observation if they sheltered a white man in their house they would be arrested on this chart and if they turned him over as a prisoner he would certainly die hena still insisted on putting him back into the sea it was none of their business according to hena from his battered cap dr sadao concluded that he was a sailor from an american warship the man was a prisoner of war he had escaped and that was why he was wounded in the back so look students hena asked if they were able to put him back into the sea Sadao then said that if the man was whole he could turn the man over to the police without difficulty. He cared nothing for the man he was their enemy all Americans were their enemy but since he was wounded Hannah understood his dilemma and realized that in the conflict between the sense of national loyalty means he was a Japanese they were Japanese so their first duty was towards their nation Japan and his duty as a doctor when they were when they were getting training in america when they were studying medicines in america they were taught by their teacher that first of all they were supposed to serve the human being then nationality comes then your national loyalty comes right it was the it was the letter which proved dominant means their duty as a doctor proved dominant since Sadao too could not throw him back to the sea the only course left for them was to carry him to their house. Sadao inquired about the reaction of the servants. Hannah said that they would tell the servants that they intended to give the man to the police means in the beginning they just wanted to save the life of a man as a humanity right it was their first duty. So, they thought that they would tell the same thing to their household servant that they have they had brought that American soldier in their house just to save his life thereafter once he could recover they would hand him over to the police in this way they only wanted to save his life somehow ok as a human being. So, Hannah said that they would tell the servant that they intended to give the man to the police she told Sadao that they must do so they had to think of the children and the doctor's position it would endanger all of them if Sadao and his wife had been put behind the bars on the charge of giving a shelter to one of the enemy soldiers what would happen to their two children who were very small they were quite confused right. So, it would endanger all of them if they did not give that man over as a prisoner of war to the police. 
Sadao agreed and promised that he would not think of doing anything else but only doing his duty as a doctor thereafter after the man had recovered they intended to hand him over to the police and that in his opinion that was all with his duty as a doctor and his next duty as a Japanese would start. So this is the answer so with this let me action my thanks to you wish you all the best stay free stay healthy stay tuned thank you